how to create a Fiverr seller account professionally in 2022, this is what we're gonna discuss in this video. In my previous video, I showed you five gigs that you could do today to make money online with Fiverr. Gigs that anyone can do with no skills, no experience, no capital, no investment. So now is your time to shine. You need to create that Fiverr account so that you can actually be able to post your gig and sell your services on Fiverr. So make sure you watch this video with me from the start till the end so that you can see how I do it and so that you can do it yourself on your end as well. So guys, to create your Fiverr seller account, you need to go to fiverr.com and you'll come to this page right here. By the way, to check the most popular gigs, this is where you can find them. Website design, WordPress, logo design, NFT art. But this is something we can talk about later on, um, maybe in another video where we talk about how to create a quality gig that brings in visitors and hopefully orders. But for now, I'm going to show you how to create your Fiverr seller account so that you can start publishing your gigs and get to work. So now what you need to do is click on join, enter your email here. I'm just going to put a dummy email so that we can show you the process. Click on continue and then choose a username. By the way, this is very important. When you're choosing your username, you have to be very careful with that because you literally are not able to change it. So make sure you choose it wisely and make sure that it corresponds to the niche that you're trying to target. When you're satisfied with your your username just choose a password make sure that you satisfy the criteria of the password eight characters or longer and make sure you combine upper and lowercase letters and numbers now click on join perfect now the next thing I need to do is go to my dummy email account and click on activate your account click on become a seller and then go right here and click on become a seller and what I like about them is they show you how to create your seller profile and publish your gig you can choose to watch this video it gives you some tips here and there click on continue and you literally cannot go wrong because they teach you everything you need to know about how to have a successful Fiverr profile they're telling you that your first impression matters create a profile that will stand out from the crowd on Fiverr obviously because there's a lot of competition so you have to create something that stands out from the crowd they're telling you to take your time add credibility by linking out uh, to your relevant pr professional networks accurately describe your professional skills to help you get more work put a face to your name this is very important if you don't put your face on Fiverr then how are people able to trust you showing your face really really matters when it comes to Fiverr and they're saying that they might ask you to verify your ID so be aware of that now click on continue and they're giving you early warnings things that you need to stay away from like providing misleading or inaccurate information about your identity soliciting other community members for work on Fiverr opening duplicate accounts Remember, you can always create more gigs, but you cannot open or create duplicate accounts and do not take anything outside of Fiverr, like communication or payments outside of Fiverr. Now click on continue. I'm just going to put a dummy name here. You can put your profile picture and I can see that they are asking you to um, put a profile picture uh, as required so maybe I'm gonna get a dummy profile picture just go for this one right here for the description write something about yourself make sure that you share a little bit about your work experience some cool projects that you've completed and your area of expertise so I'm just gonna put something like this um, the fact that I've got experience in uh, uh, graphic design I have five plus experience under my belt that kind of thing the fact that I've been working in high quality projects and the fact that I look after my clients we're working in NFTs that kind of thing just make it sound professional but at the same time uh, approachable you know like when they hear you talking they feel like they want to hire you that kind of thing language we're gonna put um, English level we're gonna put native or fluent whatever applies to you if you have any other languages you can add new and then click on continue your occupation graphics and design and then you can choose whatever um, applies to you so maybe logo design illustration whatever whatever right so I'm just gonna click some random ones again this depends on what actually applies to you choose how long you've been working in this field for uh, year from year to year and then you can add new I'm not gonna do that I'm just showing you how to do it guys so I'm not gonna waste time on it skills Adobe Illustrator, experience level, 
put intermediate or expert add and then add new just like that guys photoshop adobe photoshop experience level put expert add choose the things that apply to you education you can do that as well pretty simple guys where have you studied i'm just gonna put like uh, united kingdom something like that or united states whatever applies to you put your university or college title this is pretty easy guys if you've studied up to uh, a degree level then you can put ba if you've studied up to mba put mba whatever applies to you guys so put ba and then put um you know I don't know business management graphic design whatever whatever yeah and then add same thing certification personal websites if you have a website that you'd like to link to this is a very very good marketing tool guys and it's really good in terms of adding credibility to your um, profile so make sure you add a website if you have a website and now we're going to click on continue this is your social presence you can link your profile with google or facebook or twitter if you have a dribble or vimeo uh, profile you can link it here as well i'm not going to do that so i'm just going to click continue account security email is verified you can add a phone number to um, for an added layer of security if you want to and to finish the creation of your account you literally click on continue and create your first gig just a side note if you don't uh, complete all your information they won't allow you to proceed to the next step so make sure you uh, complete at least 65 percent of the requirements before you can proceed to the next step so things like connecting your social networks confirming your phone number providing your certifications add your experience all that kind of stuff make sure you fill out everything to make sure that you're ready to go to the next step and so that you they can accept your profile just do everything legit don't lie don't try and be smart or clever just say how it is and try and provide as much real information as possible so that they don't find any excuse not to um, you know make you proceed to the next step or accept you if you'd like me to do some more videos on fiverr let me know what kind of topics you'd like me to talk about i know i'm sure that the next logical step would be to show you how to create your first gig something professional something that is appealing how the best sellers manage to attract new customers new orders through their um, gig design and how to find gigs that are unsaturated and actually stand out in the crowd so to speak so yeah let me know guys down below in the comments um what kind of topics you'd like me to talk about and um i'll be sure to create a special video for them if you enjoyed this video and you benefited from it make sure you like subscribe comment and all that jazz and i've also done you that video of five fiber gigs that you can start today with zero experience with no skills make sure you watch it it's right here somewhere in in this screen and i'll see you in the next video take care and goodbye